Hello, my little cupcakes. I have a great story for you today. I'm going to read the words and then show you the pictures, okay? Maybe something beautiful. Here we go. In the heart of a gray city, there lives a girl who loved to doodle, draw, color, and paint. Every time she saw a blank piece of paper, Mira thought to herself, hmm, maybe. And because of this, her room was filled with color and her heart was filled with joy. So Mira is always painting and drawing. Here's her room. Look how colorful it looks. Here we go. On her way to school one day, Mira gave a round apple to Mr. Henry, the owner of a shop down the street. She gave a flower to Miss Lopez, the lady with the sparkling eyes. So she drew two pictures, an apple and a flower. She gave a songbird to Mr. Sachs and a red heart to the policeman who walked up and down the streets. On her way home, Mira taped a glowing sun onto the wall, hiding in the shadows. Her city was less gray, but not much. So a songbird and a red heart and a round sun. She's trying to share some happiness. The next day, Mira saw a man with a pocket full of paintbrushes. He gazed at the wall. He looked at her son. He held his fingers up in the square and peered through them. Hmm, he said thoughtfully, what do you see? Mira asked, maybe something beautiful, the man replied. So she saw a man with paintbrushes in his pocket and she said, what do you see? And the man said, maybe something beautiful. Maybe. Then just like that, he dipped a brush in the paint. Bam, pow, the shadows scurried away. Sky blue cut through the gloom. The man's laughter was like a rainbow spreading across the sky. Oh my goodness, look at this man painting. He's spreading happiness. So he took out his brush and paint and started creating. Mirror tipped it in the, oh, 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 one page. Who are you, Mira asked. Who are you? I'm an artist, he said, a muralist. I paint on walls. I'm an artist too, she told him. He handed me a brush. Then come on then. So he's a muralist, that means he draws on walls. And Mira said, I'm an artist too. Let's see what she does. Mira dipped in the loudest color she saw. Yeah, we, the wall lit up like sunshine. Wow, look what she's doing. So she lit up, she started drawing. She said, the wall lit up like sunshine. As the man drew pictures on the bricks, Mira added color, punch, and pizzazz. Soon Mr. Sachs joined in. Then came others. Everyone painted to the rhythm. Salsa, merengue, bebop. They were having a good time. Look at this. Everyone was painting to the rhythm. Even Myra's name painted and danced. Even Myra's mama painted and danced a cha-cha-cha. The whole neighborhood became a giant block party until, uh-oh, everyone was having a good time. Until, let's see what happens. The policeman walked up. Excuse me, he said. The music stopped. Mira put her brush down. They were surely in trouble. The officer cleared his throat, then paused. May I paint with you, he asked. So Mira handed him a paintbrush, and the music started again. So the policeman came, and they were so nervous, they were in trouble. And he said, may I join you? May I paint with you? Teachers and papas jumped in. Babies, too. Mira and the man handed out brush after brush. Color spread throughout the streets, and so did joy. So everyone was painting their neighborhood, making it beautiful. Spreading joy, spreading color, spreading art. Whenever Mira and the man went, art followed like a string on a kite. 
After they colored the walls, they painted utility boxes and benches. They decorated sidewalks and with poetry and shine, and everyone danced. Together they created something more beautiful than they had ever imagined. Oh my goodness, look at this. They're changing the, the walls are changing the, the feeling of the city. Everywhere they went, they brought beauty and art. When their clothes were splattered with a million colors, everyone sat down to rest, except the muralist. His eyes sparkled. You, my friends, are all artists, he told them. The world is your canvas. He smiled wide and pulled everything together in big sweeping motions. His paintbrush was like a magic wand. So he took what they had done and he put it, somehow joined it all together. He told them they were all artists, every one of them. When he was finished, Mira added one more bird way up in the sky. Maybe she thought, just maybe. When he was done, she started drawing up another bird up in the sky. The end. I hope you liked it. See you soon.